Aloha everybody, Kaiwazu with you, John with you. Welcome back to my channel and yeah, uh, Bath and Body Works was having a, a bit of a sale there on their candles, ten off of ten dollars off, and then there was a coupon for twenty percent off of the total order. And I really went in there to get one thing and maybe pick up a couple of candles, but I was kind of a bad boy and I got a little bit carried away and I ended up getting like uh, a lot. I got like six candles anyway. Um, and we're gonna check those out. I haven't even unwrapped them yet from the store. But the other thing, what I actually went in to check on, too, was uh, I'm sure this is probably going on in your community, and Hawaii is really bad about these kind of things. But um, since I went last, I think it was last week, to check on uh, hand sanitizers to see if they had more, and they only had one container that only had, like, Easter Bunny sanitizer in it that was all the other ones were completely sold out because everybody's gone you know coronavirus crazy oh my god we're all gonna die from coronavirus so you know they're all going in hawaii anywhere they're all going to costco and buying all the bottled water literally like i'm not joking literally and like stripping the shelves of canned goods because they are you know they're all afraid they're going to be um sequestered away in their house for months on end and Whatever. So hand sanitizers are selling out everywhere. But uh, so I went last week just to see, or yesterday, um, or what day before yesterday, whenever. Yeah, I guess it was yesterday to check. Yeah, yesterday. And, uh, and they've gotten a whole bunch of hand sanitizers in. So I got a ton because uh, I am not the person who's like waiting for the zombie apocalypse and terrified of coronavirus and all that I'm not but I just think you take um, you know good precautions which is just it's like I'm taking a lot of uh, vitamin C uh, you know extra zinc and elderberry gummies are supposed to be very good uh, so I'm taking those and then you wash your hands a lot and sanitize your hands a lot and you know I use public transit I go to thrift stores I'm in places where I just yeah I use the sanitizer a lot so I got, I have my bag here, I'm not going to take it all out, but I got um, a bunch. I got like 20 of them because they were stocked again and they were fully stocked. And she was, uh, I was laughing with a couple of the clerks that are like, yeah, it's craziness. I mean, there's people huddled all around the hand sanitizers and they're grabbing them. And I just got a whole assortment. I just got a whole bunch, 20 different kinds, different ones, whatever there was, I just grabbed an assortment because I love to take um, take these around with me and I use them all the time. I use them anyway, but I'm using them a lot more now. Anyway, so that's the first thing I bought was 20 hand sanitizers. Now candles, um, I'm really looking for tropicals, you know, because I have the other stuff and I don't need candles, but again, this was a good deal. This was the uh, $10 off and then 20% uh, off your total purchase. So it brings the candles down to like 11 60 yeah so that's about as good a deal as you're gonna get and I got six haven't even unwrapped them yet but I can tell you that the, all of what I got are new scents for me they're not scents that I've had before and I was again kind of looking for tropical so let's just see okay I'll say this really beautiful packaging right here midnight blue citrus look at that packaging. Um, I got another one in this line. Uh, the only place they had these were hiding by the register because I think maybe they've been sold out or they didn't have very many so they just had some. Nowhere else in the store except the back registers and when I saw them and I already had candles and was going to get four I had picked out and then when I saw these I just added two more because I'm like these are too beautiful. And I've not had these scents before. Midnight Blue Citrus, Juicy Citrus, Fresh Spring Water, Sweet Mango, and Essential Oils. And it smells nice. It's kind of somewhat light. Like, I don't think this is going to be a super heavy thrower. But it's a nice, fruity, tropical scent, that mango scent. And just sort of generic tropical fruitness. But that's pretty. Love that. All right, um, and I got one other in that line in here somewhere too. And I picked up uh, 
I don't know, this was sort of appealing to me. Midnight, or not midnight, hibiscus waterfall. These, this kind of boring, these just plain colors sort of things, but the wax is blue, which is nice. And this is a nice tropical scent with a little bit of water and tropicalness going on there. Tropical hibiscus, sweet peach nectar, fresh waterfall mist, fresh waterfall mist with essential oils. Now, let me be the first to tell you, in case you do not know this, as somebody who lives in Hawaii and the hibiscus is our state flower, so I can, I can tell you this with a fair amount of, of uh, you know, certainty. Hibiscus does not have a scent. <laughs> it doesn't smell. In fact, there's a famous song, Pretty Red Hibiscus, where one of the lines is, although you are not scented like the other flowers are, yada, yada, yada. It, yeah, there's no scent to hibiscus, so I don't know what they're smelling by the waterfall, but it's not a hibiscus. Peach nectar. Yeah, peach nectar, and this is just sort of that generic tropical floral scent with some peach and some water notes in it, and it smells nice, and it, again, it's a, it seems to be a little bit stronger than the other one, so I think this probably will throw well. There's that, hibiscus waterfall. What else did I get? Oh, this also was in that really pretty line that was only by the register because I didn't have very many. Coconut Cabana. That's beautiful, yeah. It says, Coconut Cream, Vanilla Sandalwood, Hint of Pineapple with Essential Oils. I love that they did different color lids on these two. And it is a green wax. These are, I love this line, really pretty. Um, there was another scent that was new in this line too that I didn't get that was some kind of reddish candle. It was okay, but I just didn't want to go so overboard. But definitely you get a light, it's somewhat, somewhat light coconut. It's not a real heavy coconut. Coconut and greenery to me. Vanilla sandalwood, hint of pineapple. Yeah, that's a real hint. I don't know. The hint is they put it on the label. Watery green coconut. That's what I would say it smells like. Which is nice. Very nice. It's pretty. Pretty. All right. I apologize for not unwrapping these before the video, but... I'm actually waiting on a friend that's supposed to come over or we're, or we're gonna go somewhere or they're coming over here or whatever and they're kind of late contacting me and I'm just like, I'm gonna film this video while I'm waiting. This one, okay, I got this one sort of by default, White Surf. Um, it's, it's weird, that weird iridescent sort of label. But um, because there was one, the last time I was in there, there was only one candle I was really interested in, and I didn't want to get just one candle, so I didn't get it. And it was, I think, Pacific Ocean Air or something like that. I'd never seen it before. This seems to be similar to that. I don't know if it's exactly the same, but um, it is Sparkling Waves Fresh Picked Lavender Silver Sage with essential oils. The other one was like aquatic with a bit of a sage and balsam, I think. So this is kind of related. I get, it, it's not identical, I guess, but it's sort of similar. It's just, it's an aqua, it's unusual. It's an aquatic scent and it has with it um, definitely lavender and definitely that sagey herbal. It's kind of weird, like aquatic with herbal it's kind of strange, but I like it. I like it. It's different, and, I'm, you know, thumbs up for doing something different. Okay, two more. Yeah, another one of these kind of boring. I mean, they're okay. I just think they're sort of boring labels, but citrus crystals. Never had this one before. This is kind of new, I think. Uh, sugared orange slices, tangy lemon drops, fizzy guava with essential oils. Yeah, this one's strong. 
And it's definitely fizzy. It has an effervescent bite to it. It's definitely like a kind of like those orange sugar jelly candy things. And lemon. Lemon drops, did they say? Yeah, I was going to say lemon drops. It's a, kind of a tart lemon in there, too. I like this one. It's a, it is citrusy, but it's not overly sweet. It has quite a bit of bite to it and effervescence, so I like that. Then the last candle that I got on this trip was... Yeah, I'd smelled this before and was like, eh, but this time I decided, yeah, let's get it. Uh, passion Fruit Vanilla Cupcake. Fresh Passion... Pff, fresh Passion Fruit Fluffy Vanilla Cake White Chocolate Truffle with Essential Oils. Yeah, it's not a super fruity scent. I mean, there's definitely like that passion fruit, tropical fruit essence there. It's definitely there. But it is also kind of a, a cake, cake-like smell to it. So I think this will be nice. Not super strong. I don't know how strong this is going to be. Not quite as strong. Kind of like that first one, the Midnight Citrus thing. But we will see. Cute label. So those are my six candles and my 20 hand sanitizers. So I will hopefully be coronavirus free. Came to a total of, with tax, $96.34 with a savings of $94. Not bad. So yeah. Have you been getting like hand sanitizers or are they running out at your store? She said they just got 12 cases in and they were probably going to run out before too long because there were so many people just picking them up. Yeah. Anyway, hope you're all great. Having a good week. Staying coronavirus free. Try not to touch your face too much. Sanitize your hands a lot. And, you know, keep calm and wash your hands, really. Bye-bye.